Today, I'm gonna to be walking you through step-by-step -step how to install a VPN on your Windows PC. Now, there are a lot of options out there for VPNs that you can use on your computer. Maybe you already have one, maybe you're looking for one, but for the purpose of this video, I'm gonna be using NordVPN, which is really an industry leader and my go-to VPN that I have on my computer myself. And if you want, you can go into the description of this video, be able to click on that and go directly to NordVPN and sign up there. And again, for the point of this video, I'm gonna be talking about how to install the app on your computer. So this is assuming you already have an account, but, but I'll show you where you'll get the account here as well. So on the main page, right across the top, you'll see download VPN. And depending on which device you're using, you wanna pick your device. And again, what we're doing is installing it on Windows. So you just click on that. It'll take you to a screen like this. And from here, you have an option to buy VPN if you haven't already uh, created an account. But otherwise, you'll just click on download app and it just takes a minute to uh, download. You can see it's up here in my download folder. We're gonna click on that uh, exe file to launch the installer and then it's going to launch the installer here. So now it says, welcome to NordVPN installer. We just click next. And then from here, we have a couple of different options. It's going to uh, obviously download the desktop app, but you can also install the browser extension or the Nord Pass, which is included, which is a secure password storage for your browser. Uh, I'm not gonna do that. I already have one of those and I'm not gonna worry about the browser extension for this, but we're gonna uh, install the desktop app. Now, again, in my case, I do already have this installed. So it is doing a reinstall, but in your case, it'll just say install here. So then you just click here, install, and then it should pop up and say installed successfully. So then we just wanna go to launch NordVPN. And then once it's installed, it'll pop up with a screen like this, and you'll just need to log into your existing account. Or again, if you don't have an account, you can uh, click on create account from here. So we're just gonna log into our account. And because it's a web-based app, it's gonna launch your default web browser to be able to sign into your account. So you'll just add your email and your password here and then click log in. And then your browser will pop up with a window like this and you just wanna open the NordVPN app again. And then as soon as it launches the app, it's gonna auto connect and it'll show up here that you are connected and the server that you're connected to. And then you can be able to access all your controls here from the dashboard, whether you're trying to connect to a different server or you wanna pause your connection or any of the other features here. And then when you close this out, it will still appear down in your tray here. So you can access it anytime that way. Otherwise, you can just leave it in the background and every time that you boot up your computer, it'll launch automatically and you have the peace of mind of knowing that you're securely connected to the internet no matter what application you're using on your computer to access the internet. It's still gonna go through your VPN. I hope you found this helpful and I will see you in the next one.